The use of this endothelial cell culture system enables the simulation of the situation in the blood flow. And with this situation, we can analyze bacterial infection processes, also including the identification of bacterial factors and also of cell factors which are involved in these processes. This technique paves the way to explore the impact of bacterial infections on the vascular integrity, also including the impact on thermogenesis mechanisms, on inflammation responses and immune regulation. This technique requires some special handling of the endothelial cells and therefore in the visual description is better than just a verbal explanation. This method provides insights into several other areas of research correlated with perfused vascular systems, such as endothelial cell differentiation, wound healing, tumor genesis and angiogenesis. One of the key steps is um, standardized cell cultivation as well as the accurate handling of primary endothelial cells. This technique requires some special cell culture handling which um, couldn't be clear by just verbal explanation. To begin, work in a sterile environment using a clean bench. Use a pipette to inject 100 microliters of a 2% sterile filtered porcine gelatin PBS solution into a single reservoir of a temperature equilibrated channel slide. Place the gelatin coated channel slide on a thin polystyrene or styrofoam plate to prevent a drop in the slide temperature. With a 1 milliliter